Hello everyone, uh, I hope you will enjoy this session about creating a Jenkins pipeline and uh, taking advantage of Docker containers. The main goal of this session, um, actually there will be multiple sessions until the main goal is achieved, but uh, the main goal is to create a pipeline like in this um, image. I will, uh, I will use a single computer a single laptop for shaping this pipeline it runs Windows 7 and the Jenkins master will run on Windows 7 while the Linux machines are virtual machines provided by VirtualBox and each of these machines will have a docker if you try to accomplish the same pipeline on uh, Windows 10 then uh, you don't need VirtualBox anymore okay uh, now let me let me introduce you a few headlines about uh, the, the Linux machines first we have the test machine which uh, it will be used for testing here we will uh, we will run the unit tests the integration tests we will run jcoco for, for code coverage and uh, we will run several code analysis static code analysis tools like uh, findbacks checkstyle and pmd and finally we will run uh, sonar the next uh, machine is the pf machine uh, this uh, pf cam uh, is just a shortcut for performance so uh, the performance machine will uh, run uh, several uh, extra software because this is like a production machine it will need an application server it will run uh, Payara server it needs a database in this case uh, we will use Postgre and uh, the performance tests that will be accomplished here are provided by JMeter Next, we will have several machines uh, for further testing as a QA machine, user acceptance test, and any other machine from uh, this uh, category. And uh, finally, we have the prod machine. This is the production machine which uh, is used for uh, deploying our application. Okay, uh, in the middle of uh, pipeline, we have Artifactory uh, and uh, this is proxied by an nginx uh, server the artifactory will be used by developers and uh, by the pipeline as well okay the application that we will use is not uh, is not important the important fact is that uh, it is a maven application maven based application in this case it is a spring mvc application but uh, it can be uh, any other maven based application for, for example it can be an enterprise java server faces based application okay so uh, mainly we will have a jenkins master running on windows 7 and a bunch of uh, linux machines that are uh, acting as uh, jenkins slaves or agents so um, this is how our pipeline will uh, will work um, mainly based on uh, what you will see in the next sessions you can uh, shape this pipeline as you like uh, there is no there is no rule this depending on on uh, what you try to achieve based on this you can uh, provide multiple machines or a single machine we can run all the containers in it or you can choose different uh, kind of architecture uh, it's all depend on you okay so now i will see you in the next session when uh, i will introduce you the docker images that will be used for uh, for our pipeline bye bye